I graduated from Xavier University in 1963. And I think within a few weeks, I was working at NASA. I had always thought that I'd just leave and become a math teacher when I graduated because at that time in history, that's the kind of jobs that were available. I think you mean as a, a black woman in the 1960s, there were some jobs that were just out of reach. Yes. When the movie Hidden Figures came out, what did you think of it? I said, this is my story. There are three ladies here, and almost everything, especially in the beginning of the movie, was so similar to what I had gone through. Having to travel from a distance because you couldn't find a place to live immediately where you worked because of your race. And then you had to learn all this new material to be trained as a mathematician. It's not the same as being trained in computers, in computer languages. And it just brought back all the memories of things that I had gone through. Do you think of your story as empowering to another generation of women? Yes, I do. I went back to to school later in life for a PhD. And I changed my area from, bi from, from math to microbiology. And one of the professors told me, don't you think you should just go home and go back with your family, your children? Don't let anyone stop you from reaching your goals. And if it's something you want to do, you may have to devote a lot of time. You may have to sacrifice social life. But if that's what you want to do, you should go for it.